everyone. Thank you for joining us here for Crime 2 News First at 4. I'm Whitney Ward. We begin with breaking news tonight. The trial of the man accused of killing four University of Idaho students will likely not begin in October. The suspect, Brian Koberger, waived his right to a speedy trial in a Lataw County courtroom today. We want to turn right now to Crime 2's Janelle Finch, who was in the courtroom this afternoon. Janelle. Whitney, like you said, just a few hours ago, we learned that Brian Koberger may not be appearing here at the Lataw County Courthouse for trial in October. Today, he waived his right to a speedy trial. Cooney County Public Defender Ann Taylor says there just isn't enough time to review state evidence and prepare for trial in October. Koberger walked into the courtroom Wednesday, prepared to waive his right to a speedy trial. After his attorney Ann Taylor explained her reasons to prolong the trial, the state agreed more time would be beneficial. Lataw County Prosecutor Bill Thompson says while the state would like to wrap up this trial quickly, more time would allow for a more effective counsel. The judge says this case is, quote, significant and complicated. He approved Koberger's waiver of speedy trial, which means a new trial date will need to be scheduled. The state requested that trial be scheduling be discussed after a hearing next Friday. The court is set to meet to review the defense's challenges to the grand jury indictment. That hearing is still scheduled. The deadline to submit challenges on that indictment is today. We don't know what this means for the jury selection at this time. We do know that Judge John Judge has received requests for exemption or excusal from potential jurors. He asked that the prosecution and defense be present for those requests to approve them, but no one has been approved at this time. Live from the Lataw County Courthouse, Janelle Finch, Crumpton News.